Hi, welcome. There is a question. This is what we're working on. We're working on Xmonad. And the best way to test something is really to just do it, right? To work on it. So we are in the testing phase for Xmonad. There is a question about um, some database or something, movie database, <coughs> downloads, how to install it. And the, I've never seen it before, but uh, let's give it a try. So my music database, my video database, I don't know what the M stands for, but let's get it. Um, well, first off, well, I've downloaded it already, but why not first see if anybody knows this, my MDB, etc. So no packages match search. So nobody created a package built for it. So that would be the easiest way to install something is a, a, a UR, so Arch User Repository. Um, so I guess that's a no-go, depending if there is a hyphen maybe somewhere in between. So there is MD book. Might be possible that there is another way of um, writing it. Uh, so we know the MDB tools, there's something for Microsoft Access database files, something we've learned now. So that's possible if we want ever want to do that. So you go over lists of possible names and if you don't find it, well, we don't find it. So that's the source. Um, let's go to our download which is um, this one, extract here, that's the one, and DBA, start anleitung, oder PDF für Windows, oder für Linux, machen wir für Linux, okay, open up, a little bit small for me, what's it saying, whoa, We have to start it with jar, Java something, jar. Okay. But the question is, of course, do we have Java installed or not? I don't know. So Java, is that there? There is no Java. So first thing is maybe yay, Java. Now, I hope we still have the website. It says something here about Java. Voraussetzung zum Starten is the Java runtime app version 8 or the 8. Mm -hmm. So we need version 8 from Java runtime. So we're gonna look for it. Is it somewhere up here? And maybe we can make it a little bit smaller by saying Java runtime. And we get let loss let uh, less. Uh, less applications. So starting from 8, it's okay. 7, 10, 11. I would say I start with 11 since that's the last one. So number 2. Running that one. And let's see if it's ready for number 11. Because it might be written for 8 and that's uh, why we have issues. Of sh you can have issues. So alas, we're still in that thing. It says I can start it like this. Um, um, I guess I'm better type Java now. I have Java and it says down here order Java slash so minus not slash mess this one and then that one. And it's going to quickly open up and close down again. So that's one thing. Is it a version issue? Should uh, figure that out first. So sudo pacman minus r java runtime common is there. Anything else? That's it. Okay. Yes, there is something else. Here e open gtk. That's one thing. And gr open. And anything else? Okay, so remove the packages again. 
going for Java runtime 8 this time. See if that works. 8 is number 8. That's conveniently. And move up, move up, move up, move up. That's the one. And this one opens up. So it's definitely an, uh, a Java issue. It's not an Arch Linux issue. It's something about versions. So this seems to be something for data version. A database you can make up and import here and export here and bearbeiten. Über MDB and so weiter. Schließen. I think you can, let's see if we can. Einstellungen. Let's kill this one. That one. Let's open it up again. Just wanted to see if the, we have here uh, languages, filter, group, spalten, ansicht, spalten, anordnung, filmen, data, updates, default settings, English. Oh yeah, that's just for the, the sound and all that. It's not for the program or the application. don't think there is a translation in here. But it seems to work and that's the most important thing. So we can tell the user here that you need a lower version. Simple as that and then it will work. All right, so um, concluding this video here. Where is my video here? Cheers.